Uh, I messed up again, guys. Quit strangle me. <coughs> In case you're wondering what I'm talking about. <laughs> oh, there. Alrighty. So we're just going to do this thing. It's this V-Log 3rd of May. Um, 2024. I'm going to do some DoorDash soon. In the meantime, I'm going to do get a, um, get some food. And I've got work later on tonight. Toothache sort of simmered down a bit. It's not too bad at the moment. It comes and goes. It's sort of, um, did some lawns yesterday. Nothing major. Um, anxiety's still, you know, uh, still bad at it. One of those dreams last night. I had the adrenaline flowing through my system again. Um, ah, and, um, let me check my blood pressure. I haven't really done that yet lately. But, uh, we'll see what happens. Anyway. That's better. Look at that. Now I've got the sun on my face and everything like that. Anyway, oh dear. Anyway. Let's go. <coughs> the idea is do some DoorDash and do some um get some shopping. Go for a bit of a walk. Oh, and we'll see what happens. There's a chance I might be starting up that lawn mowing business um, a bit more in earnest to see what I can do. So we'll see. Might even advertise it on here actually. So if you're in the Howick area, actually, I'm going to do this. If you're in the Howick area, um, Howick East Auckland, New Zealand, and you want your lawns done, contact T Rex. <laughs> Mr. Grassmaster's mowing. Shoot me around with my shirt on. Go on my Facebook page, Instagram, or whatever. I don't know. There you go. That's my preliminary crude attempt at advertising. So, yes, indeed. Alrighty. Okay, we're done the shopping. Got these, um, got my usual raw energy, nothing milk. On special, oh, I want to say it's on special, it's a lot cheaper than what it normally is. You get this milk for like just over three dollars, like about three dollars sixty or something like that. So it's like, um, it's a lot cheaper than what you normally get in this country. You know, I me, mean, I like having a bit of a wine, but the state of the pricing, um, especially with milk and meat, as we produce it, which is super really cheap here. Anyway, got this as well. This is like vanilla for coffee, but I put it in milk and I put it in a blender. That's my latest little creation. And it's freaking nice. <laughs> Even if I got toothache, because I've been drinking a lot of milk actually and lately, because it's really good for toothache. That seems to cool your tooth down. It sort of gives you a bit of, bit of something in your stomach as well. Because um, when you've got, um, I find um, when your stomach aches, your tooth aches. Oh, I don't know if it might be something to do with inflammation and all that your body produces. Because you know the story. <laughs> The nerve gets inflamed in your tooth, it pushes against the wall of the tooth, and that's what makes it hurt like, hurt like fucking buggery. And if you've ever had toothache, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. <laughs> it's pain city, man. So I know several um, little um, home home remedies ah, for our toothache, because I, being a um, toothless dude myself, I, um, I love my sugar. You can see that one there. That's been that was that about eroded away, um, you know, quite a bit. Didn't have any dramas with that one, but um, never had that one pulled. It just eroded away. So um, most of the ones I've been pulled, I've been on my bottom jaw on my left, on the back. It's like those hurt. So I ain't getting that done anymore. It's gonna let them erode away, erode away and die in their own terms. But it becomes pretty painful. So you got a way, have a way of dealing with the pain when it does arrive. It comes in stages and waves and all that sort of shit. It's like, you know, as your little... Some days will be good, some days it won't be. So, um, yeah. You know, we're going to head to Cobble Bay, guys. We're not getting any uh, DoorDash deliveries. We're going to head to Cobble Bay. We're going to have a little walk. Okay, we're at Cobble Bay, guys. There you go. So I'm not lying. Alrighty. Ah, I haven't done for a while. Here we go. 
and get some water. I might get in a camper van actually gallivanting around the country, that sounds like a good idea at the moment I'm just doing on public transport I can sleep in the, like the, you know, buses and all that sort of stuff oh. on the trains just drift around the country for a bit oh. it'd be quite cool Sorry. Don't forget if you want your lawns dug in, you live in Howard. Comment below and I'll, I'll give you half price if we do it on even this channel. Oh, how about that? Just gotta be local though. I'm not gallivanting halfway around the city. Look at this. Right up here. Oh, I won't go too far. There's a door there. There's a good little bloody hike up here, isn't it? Gets me a bit of adrenaline. Oh. Oh. Yes, indeed, it gets rid of the adrenaline. Oh, it's good. Oh, someone's made a seat for me too. I don't know what we're going to call this seat, but... Nice. Still wear for a bit. I'm not going to go up any further than this. Head back to the car very soon. Very pleasant around here. You know me. Dull old man boomer tucks. Oh, most of the last um, <laughs> video of um, all the videos I took of the um, warbirds on Anzac Day, so posted that video up. So check that one out. It's a big, it's my big, all the videos, so it's a bit bigger. Oh. 
what's been happening. Be like May 3rd, 2024. Oh, nothing much actually, I'm back on DoorDash. So everything's good at the moment. Oh, ice cream place seems too bad, it's not too bad. So you can feel it's coming and going. But it's just like a background pain most of the time. Most of it, sometimes it doesn't even hurt at all. Anxiety's alright. And I'm checking my blood pressure at the moment. Not any party poopers at the moment, eh? Blood pressure and almost a party pooper, but what I've been doing, I think I've been having been, you need to really sit down and relax and take it over a long period of time so you get an accurate reading. <laughs> with, um, not with blood pressure. Don't check it just after you come out of the car or off a walk or anything like that. It's going to be high. <laughs> so I'm learning a bit more about blood pressure and what it actually is and how it varies. It varies a hell of a lot. <laughs> I'm back and take my pill. I took a bit of a break from my pill but because I thought it was going to, just in case I'm a too fake flare, that was going to taste to take a painkiller. I don't really want to mix it too. Anyway guys, going back to the car. Now I am sitting in my kitchen again. Just chilling. Ah! I'm going to cook up some of this pizza I had the other day. Oh! Ah! Bloody anxiety. Yeah. We good though. A bit of walker burns up, burn off some of that adrenaline, which was good. Ah, so I'm here. Just show you around the backyard for a bit. Ah, ah looking a lot better. Obviously, better stuff around the far corner over there. Ah, but um, there's a bit of space there. Ah, did some did a lawn yesterday, so emptied some of the clippings there. It makes the grass grow a bit better. Ah, so it's looking good. And clearing this bit out too. So it's clearing all this part out. Ah, so I might do some more of that pretty soon actually. Oh, that was all overgrown before that's been cleared out. Ah, so I just clean all that one out there. Yes, indeed. It's starting to take a bit of shape now. Ah, so yeah. Next I need to do is um, get some more water. Ah, oh, I don't need a sink. Wash my dishes and clean the floor up with it. <laughs> Out of running water in this place. It's the old um oh the valve went on the um hot water cylinder so there's leaks everywhere. Pain in the ass. Alrighty guys. Oh, there's my see though, remember them? My rats, I used to keep my rats in those, but we ain't got no rats anymore. So I don't think we've got really got any running around. Oh I'm trying to lure some back. We do have a cat, the cats that come every now and then. So yeah. Do you know why um, I have socks, which is a uh, my cat that yet was born of mine? So yeah, that was um oh back um back in 2012 we got got socks. And now socks is around the place somewhere. She doesn't really she comes back occasionally. She hasn't been back for about a week. So um when she does I'll put some more videos up here. So the people seem to like watching those. So some of my better videos are actually of socks. Oh, oh no, there's an outside chance. Oh, I may actually get a cat, an old kitten, but we'll see, but you see, um, we'll check it out with my former flatmate, my business partner, so um, we might be going back into business, the four of us, my current flatmate, oh, my former flatmate, and business partner, and um, his mum's friend, oh, I so there might be four of us getting into the lawn, so that'd be pretty cool, I wouldn't mind doing that, but in the meantime, oh, we're going to just slowly grow in this lawn mowing business and see what happens, we've got three, three customers at the moment, and then all people I know, so uh, yeah. Oh, we'll see what happens. So if you want to become um, number four, comment below. <laughs> we'll see what we can do here for a living, how it going. I don't really like traveling. It's local, local only, guys. All right. Yeah, you know, guys, it's your um, third of um, third of May. I know your um, your boomer tuck and your um, yeah, this house up there. Ah, oh, and um, backyard. It's a bit of a landscaping um, work in progress as well. I didn't get any uh, door dashes. There's actually been a bit of a drought with um, uh, deliveries at the moment. I've been getting some decent deliveries on Hell Pizza, but uh, a door dash and, and Uber Eats have been pretty quiet. 
hopefully uh, hopefully I might I hope to change that this weekend get a few deals going on I think once it gets busy again it'll be on because the moment's pretty quiet anyway guys peace out